Hey guys, as promised, uh, here is the comparison uh, video of uh, two of the Apex uh, famous uh, Pro uh, doubles rackets. Okay, so these are uh, high-end uh, range of uh, Apex rackets that are uh, uh, specially uh, designed in and developed uh, in Taiwan for uh, a couple of uh, doubles. Uh, international players and uh, as the name says uh, I have played with them and uh, they are really good and I can compare uh, these two with Astrox 89D and 89S I mean even um, those rackets are widely used by uh, many of the doubles uh, players in the international circuit and uh, if you have uh, researched or uh, trying to uh, buy uh, these two rackets you would, you, would, you would be definitely confused which one to go for because if you see the specs either uh, in the international pack site or wherever you are buying both reads exactly same and uh, the only difference uh, they claim is that the Pro Commander shaft is 0.1 mm thinner than Acilient Pro. So that means this is 6.8 mm thick shaft and this is 6.9 mm. So I mean definitely uh, in your, um, I mean it doesn't uh, feel any different at all when you are you know, looking at the racket. But other than that, I mean everywhere if you see, if you read, uh, the specs mentioned that exactly same so I was pretty much confused when I was buying uh, these two rackets and uh, with one of my friends feedback what I did is I went ahead and first bought Apex Pro Commander uh, I mean which I thought uh, should match my playing style then uh, I played with this for a month or so and then uh, I, mean, I mean a month or so and I mean I was very impressed by its performance and the feel and how it plays so that's why I went ahead and bought uh, the other uh, cousin brother of this racket as well which was which is Apex Asilian Pro so I played with that as well and even though the specs are same there is a quite a lot of uh, difference uh, when you are playing with these two rackets so the first thing you notice is that uh, this one is uh, more of an even balance to slightly head heavy balance and this is a head heavy a clearly a head heavy uh, racket so that is the that is one of the major difference so other than that what i feel is uh, the shaft stiffness of uh, acilian pro is little stiff slightly on higher side as compared to pro commander maybe because of uh, the slimmer uh, thickness i mean slimmer shaft of uh, acilian pro commander which makes it more uh, flexible and uh, both of these racket weigh exactly same so when uh, doing i mean so let me let me just uh, go over and show you the rackets and the specs what is printed here so let's start with pro command so this is the pro commander racket so yeah so this is a white black uh, with some purple accent racket so it can take up to a 38 lbs and uh, so it's printed as doubles specialist and as, as all apex racket uh, the frame is made up of frp fiber reinforced polymer okay so let me show the specs It's 4U G2 84 plus R minus 2 uh, 
and the balance point is 293 plus or minus 3 and flex is 8.5 so if you see this Even this is same 82 g2 so 84 plus or minus 2 balance point is 293 plus or minus 3 and 8.5 flex so same i mean both i mean apex claims both are with the same spec so after uh, i mean after doing lot of research and after playing with them what i found is uh, there is a slight difference in the way uh, this head racket head uh, frame is made up of okay so apex pro commander uh, is having uh, an aerodynamic frame here and here oh, i think this is semi box so the aero frame is only here in apex Pro Commander and here it is boxy here it is semi boxy uh, oval as well as boxy here, here also oval as boxy frame so that's what that is the only difference I found I mean here it's an aero frame here here and here and all other is a complete boxy frame there's no semi boxy what it, uh, how it looks so that is the only difference I see uh, if you clearly see the frame uh, that's what is the difference and i think that's that is what uh, is making uh, these two rackets play in a different way so as per uh, uh, what i feel is uh, if you are uh, kind of an even balanced player and uh, looking for a very easy to play racket uh, with very fast uh, defensive characteristics uh, you can go for pro commander and if you want a little additional head weight and if you are an offensive player who gets your point using uh, fast smashes you can go for Asilian pro so look wise i like uh, the look of Asilian pro but uh, uh, otherwise uh, both are uh, very good rackets to play with so if you have a budget you can try both of them and uh, without any uh, much of a uh, difference you can switch between these two rackets for sure that's what i i feel so when you need little more power uh, in the head uh, i switch to this racket and when i am playing a a defensive and game I go with this racket so let's quickly weigh these rackets and see uh, how much this weigh exactly okay so let me start with Apex Pro Commander weighs around 89 grams uh, with the uh, Yonex uh, Nano G99 string and a thin grip and <coughs> Asilian Pro actually weighs around yeah around 90 grams just a one gram here and there that's because uh, I have added uh, a lead tape here to uh, counter uh, the head heaviness what it has here just to uh, suit my requirement so both of these rackets weigh around eight. I mean playable weight of both of these rackets are uh, I mean is 89 gram okay so yeah I think uh, that's all uh, so these two are a uh, couple of uh, my favorite rackets and uh, if you are looking for uh, a racket in the range of 5000 uh, really don't look for a mid-range unix or leaning and just if you have a chance or if you have seen this with your friend just 
try to play with them and then i can decide so what i feel is these are an excellent uh, uh, pro rackets from apex and uh, one more thing i uh, forgot to mention is that these rackets are made up of um, an excellent uh, high i mean high quality uh, carbon fiber uh, graphite basically so the shaft of both of these rackets are made up of 50t japan hm graphite and the frame is made up of 30t uh, japan hm graphite so the 50t is uh, uh, like as you can uh, research or see uh, it's it's it is used by used in most of the very high end i mean top end rackets from unix or Lenin. so so it uses the same material and you you get these rackets uh, for almost half of the price of those high end rackets so i think that's all guys so if you have any further uh, question about these two rackets please uh, let me know comment and share uh, thank you